So some time ago, popular Yugi tuber Simo started something called Master Duel Masochist, a challenge series in which a brand new account builds a deck out of five master packs, and with every win, you gain a new one as well as any bonus legacy packs to improve it. So we watched it and thought, this looks fun, let's give it a shot. What is up everybody, it's Toaster Corgi Gaming with the Master Duel Masochist run again. And if you watched the last video, holy crap, we were on a massive loss streak. <laughs> It's like, oh yeah, we get some good cards. Here's your punishment for it. You gotta go through way too many losses, screw up badly many times just to finally win against a burn deck. But that doesn't matter, because we won and we get the one pack. One pack. We were so happy. That I have hopes for. Inverse universe. Well, effect most of Be super good for our defensive plays. That'll be super good. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Gear Golem. We can switch its attack and deal 2200 damage directly for 800 life points. Raider's Wing. This card is in your hand or gravity. You attach material from your dark exceeds monster. Special summon this card, but vanish when it leaves the field. Okay, not terrible. It's a 2,000 wall. It's another defensive play. Danger, excitement, mystery. Discard level 5 higher danger. We don't have one. Divine Dragon, Apocrylith. Switching you discard a card, target a dragon time monster in your graveyard. Add the target to your hand. Okay, also works. And it's discard. Pegasus Wing, Union Monsters. Doesn't work. Gravekeeper's Headsman. Very low for Gravekeeper and Grave. We don't have those. Magical Musket, we don't have, and... <sighs> really? Really? Just go to the bath. Just go to the... Let's just go to the Legacy Packs. That sucks. Okay. Pump King, the King of Ghosts. He's a by one points. Okay, um not that great. That's probably not going in the deck. Try and pronounce that. Well, this does work if we want to do pendulum plays, depending on how much or how high our pendulum scale is. If you would take effect damage, you take no damage. Okay. That's not bad. We could probably put that in there as a Pendulum Summon. Rallus the Starbird? A good level of monsters that battles times 200 during the damage step only. If this card tax is removed from play at the end of the damage step, return to the beginning of your next bat turn's battle phase. Okay. What? I got nothing. Uh, is this Madolce or New Morelia? I think it's Madolce Manor. Blue eyes. Oh yeah, Outburst Dragon. Okay, so we can't attack that. 
because then they're just going to get a blue eyes on the field. Well, we can't even summon that because we need two. And when a card effect is activated, that targets this card. You can special summon the blue eyes white dragon from hand deck or graveyard. When it's targeted for attack, you can negate it, change the position, then special summon blue eyes white dragon from hand deck or graveyard. Yeah, explain to me the out to that, other than non targeting removal. for card destruction. I don't see how we out that without summoning a stupid blue eyes. A few moments later. Alright, I, I am not winning this bullshit. Shiranui's? We'll say, that's interesting. Well, we're gonna need this in play. Okay, they're gonna be special summoning from the graveyard. A lot. I don't think they have level... No, no, wait, my Akashi's an odd number synchros. I think they had even number synchros. And now that Shiranui Shade is in the... Spectral Sword is in the graveyard, they can synchro from the grave. Yep, there they go. Spreader zombie. And because they weren't summoned from the graveyard, they were summoned via Bannet from the Banish pile. They can just synchro again or into a level 8. Or hell, they can go into a level 12 if they want. And monsters, they control, can't just show up a card effects. Well, not, not anymore. Kogan Saga. Okay, that's not nice. You would be so useful. Yeah, that's gonna hurt, like, a lot.
We actually did it. <laughs> I think they're going to go for Sun Saga next. Which, if it activates stability, I can Divine Wrath it. I'm pretty sure they could just activate it again. Shogun again. It's just an infinite loop combo. And unfortunately, they're not special summoning from the graveyard. So my card is not doing anything. Leaf would be very useful right now. Now they're going to synchro again and then synchro it back into Shogun. No, they're going to go straight into Sun Saga. Well, it's game over. Masochist mode. We could probably just remove Exo Sister Irene. Probably wouldn't be a bad idea. I mean, if we can get Brow the Huntsman here, then we're good. Okay, they're a starter deck. I think they're the Link deck for the Beckoned by the World Chalice deck. We didn't put fine down. It's not like normal monsters will have any effects to negate. I could literally be building my new model kit while waiting on their turn.
late night. Can our scrap deck build a default deck? Yeah, I'm just gonna be that guy in the card artwork. Just launch me into space. Well, we've broken their back, Rose. Huh, late night negates flip effects. You control no other monsters. Blade Knight would be good with Infernities, just for that slight attack boost. Very slight, but uh, nothing. Summon a monster. We've all faced up effect monsters, so technically they're chosen or beckoned by the world chalice is unaffected. How about that? It's almost like they drew the perfect card at the right time. summon? Well, that makes uh, our trap card... Nope. Exceeds. Catchy coochie dragon. Thirty-six. It literally comes down to this last turn. That's just still on the field. And that stat change is permanent. Earth machines. We don't have any other earth machines. The problem is that we got so much junk that we can't get any actually good stuff. Actual good stuff. Any actually good stuff. Yeah. Can't get any good English either. As soon as a monster, we're dead. Talk about convenience, huh? Also, the uh, TG event, the event, TG deck with the event, not only did it have a uh, the previous cards that it really could have used, like the trap card for recycling your TG monsters from the graveyard back into the deck. So why it's not in that deck, I'll never know. But it also had no removal. No back row removal, other than Wonder Magician. Like, that's it. Like, 
What is it with some of the decks they make being complete ass? Okay, we have Gleef. And if a trap is activated, I can send the top card of the deck to the grave and special summon Naturia Rock. We have card card D, we got Anesthetic Rocket, and Familiar Possessed Kita. Blue Eyes deck. but they don't have any monsters so far. Well, they can't tribute summon. Because I know that deck has Kaiser Glider. So, destroying that means they can't summon it because we can't out it. You're not attacking? I'm wide open. Was there a rule in the original Yu-Gi-Oh! anime, the Duelist Kingdom arc, where they could only attack with one monster per turn? So I feel like there was. Even though some duelists were cheating after Duelist Kingdom, and with the actual rules in place, they didn't do anything about it. Okay, that's not good change the defense position at the end of the damage step. Okay. Let's see what we're working with. But it's switched defense. Means we can go with Goki Twist Cobra. And if they activate their trap card. I'll hold off on Scrap Shark. Because if they just activate that, then he's gonna get popped anyway. See? talking about that's luck. That is probably one of the best things we could have milled. I think we may have a chance here. Okay, come on. Big money, gotta come. it's safe just to get some more cards because we can use the pot we can use it now while we're ahead it 
They can banish the other card. I should have special summoned Quinness. Abunicia. Abunicia. You're not going to attack. You are going to attack. Why wouldn't you go? Probably because it's still weaker. It's not like we could special summon anything anyway. Defense draw. The twin headed behemoth's effect is only once per duel. Wait, what was their logic behind that back then? Okay. Sky Strikers, we don't stand a chance because Sky Strikers are bullshit. Because they keep getting support. That whole duel, I'ma just that blue eyes asshole. I'm the just either cut the whole video or just cut the highlights where the game started bugging out. So you want me to win? How about you make him DC? So if you wanted to end, I had a chance and they were letting me. Okay, not a bad going second hand. We got Hita, Angel of Seven.
speed roid. So we'll have a monster in play. Of course they have Lightning Storm. If we can get Angel 07 on the field as fast as possible, then we can actually shut them down entirely. Of course they're going to summon two and immediately synchro. This is the first time I fought a pure speedroid player. Still don't like it, but... I do like how they're, all the speedroid monsters are made themed around children's toys. I do like that. Don't know what half of them are. A Hagoita? Looks like a badminton racket. Dice. Stilts. And... Whatever that is, a Daiden? Denden? And a cork shooter. Special summon all of them! Now it's a level 5, so now they're gonna go into level 8. Not a once per turn effect either. Now they're gonna go into level 10. Nope, level speed. They're going fast dragon. Are they gonna OTK? Level 10, high riser. Nope, level eight. Crystal clear wing. useful last turn, even though it's once per turn. Send a wind monster from the deck to the graveyard. Another Dido Duke, Denden Daiko Duke. Also, the Raider. Raid Raptors and Phantom Knights did not need to hybridize into one like the stupid heroes did. It's like, stop hybridizing archetypes just to make them more playable. Raid Raptors are already annoying as it is. You keep giving them more and more support, and now they got a rank 13, which they didn't deserve. Drake is kind of cool. Like, why do we play monsters originally? Because they were cool looking? Except that one. You say got the treatment, so you go gets it. Like Shadow Gale, you thought you had bad luck? No. Trust me, you don't. Yeah. 
Maybe we should ditch the trap card fine, because it hasn't really been usable. The problem is that we lack draw power. That's the problem. We lack a lot of stuff. It's like we literally just play till we get one win. from an ex a dark Xyz monster. We have one, we just can't use it. Did we put the... that... that DDD card? The DDD Declan? Did we put that in? I'm pretty sure we put it in. Because we could use it for some pendulum summons. What are you? Supe Duskwalker. Synchro Summon. Goatee. How about no? Get rid of that. <laughs> we are getting rid of our fines. Okay, so if you banish it, negate its effects. So technically, you banished it. Yeah, I think I will. One time we need Angel of Seven. The one time. You can banish two fish monsters and special stuff on this card from the hand. Because why not? Now they can immediately sink for summon because Goatee has no balancing. Sword Soul player, I'm out. <laughs> they play one Sword Soul, I'm just getting a tap. player. Doesn't matter if you go first or you go second, if you're a masochist, you're not winning. And they got all that.
So yeah, I bought all that stuff too, but I'm not playing Blue Eyes because I have something called Standards. And self-respect. And I ain't touching Dark Magician either. I would rather play re pure Red Eyes, honestly, because at least they have some flavor. Actually pulled. First time we've drawn Apocrylith. I'm pretty sure. And how many archetypes are there in the game that actually have a multitude of different or types? That's not fur hire. Okay, it's a Maju to I Grand Maju to Aiza or Ishizu slash Tier Limits. I haven't seen Tier Limits in quite a while, and those were also BS. And it's like, hey, uh, Konami, why don't you stop? for 10 seconds and think. I mean, hell, for God's sakes, back in the day, y'all had a time. There was a time when y'all would literally Oh yeah, they get banished. Blossom. Mm -hmm. It's like we just ban the hand traps. Let's see, dimensional fissure. Not banned. Go to hell. Trap card. Like, this is literally my one back row removal. We got Curry Volt in our hand. I don't know if we can summon it Thunder Dragon Lord with it. What's it gonna be? Yep. Annoyance. Like if I had a tier list, if I made a list of every deck that makes you an asshole for playing, it would just be a mile long. Just be any deck that's not something in particular. Basically anything from today's era. And this thing in particular. We need a tournament that is literally for casual play only. Like a local card shop, local card shops have their tournaments, right? They need to host one and advertise it saying it's casual only, pure casual. If you are using any competitive level cards that are used in competitive play or any competitive strategy, you get the boot. Like you get booted out immediately. Like if you're playing Zodiac back in Japan. 
Yeah, fun fact. Uh, Zodiac was so prominent that if you were playing at a local card shop... That's new. If you were playing at a local card shop and running any Zodiac cards, they ha you were thrown out on the spot. Now I'm like, gee, Konami, it's almost like you uh, playtest nothing. Because when the top 16 to 32 people are using it, I think y'all messed up somewhere. But no, you won't accept the, take the blame because you can't do anything wrong. Keeper Dragon Magic. I do like that card. Like, I love the design. Just super cool. Like, I would keep that as a background or a poster on my wall. Does anybody... Do anybody still have posters? Like, to decorate your bedroom with? Been at this for an hour and a half. Another card that didn't deserve to be made. And now we're getting a new version of this, which didn't need to get made. But here we are. Tribute or Synchro or Fuse. your earth, but Melfi Penny is water attribute for some reason. I did something. I did damage. I think Assault Wyvern was from the movie. The Dark Side of Dimensions. Yeah, that or it's a, um... Zexel card used by Mazar, I think. I think was his name.
needed Warblin on the field last turn and being able to chain the effects of... Yes, 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 yes! Oh, oh, my God, we did it. We won. Savannah.